Check out guys, I'm in raw stress for last, looking for shoes again. Let's see what we can find today. Oh, I'm digging some boots right here. Oh, what are these? Oh, it's not polo. You don't see these often. Look at this. I wonder what's the price. All hooked up. $69.99. Look at this. Regular one $25. Oh, wow. Look at this. It says 100% cow leather upper. 100% sheep lining. How many of you guys are a fan of boots especially with the winter coming and you live in the area with a lot of snow this is a very stylish and elegant way to show off so this pair of elegant ranger tumbled leather boots Featured tumble leather which has been washed with stones to give that oiled and waxed look for durability and styling. Notice the elegant hand stitching on the rounded toe. You also have the lace up front with metal grommets. See, classic finish right there. The laces are also made of rawhide leather. Now this is what makes it totally stylish. You have this adjustable buckle strap over the vamp area to add that extra level of tightness. It kind of reminds me like electric athletic shoe with the Velcro, you know, the gym shoes, but this is different. Also featuring a rugged lug also. That's pretty thick right there. That looks like a little bit over one inch or so, right? Here's what the bottom look like. Perfect for traction control. Also, also the Polo Country logo right there. And here's what the interior looks like. See? Actually, let me shine some light in there. See that Polo look? And there is the sizing right there. Okay. Cow leather upper. And this is what the interior looks like. Quite comfortable room. And let's go ahead and try this out. So I just realized Polo Ralph Lauren was established in 1967, which makes it about 55 years of existence. And here's a comparison between my US size men 9 to the 8 um, of the Polo. Not too much of a difference, maybe like uh, okay. half an inch at most. So because of the bulk go, it might take a little bit getting used to. Getting in there might be a little bit tight, but don't forget you have these eyelets to help you uh, remove the shoes. All right, it's in. Took a little bit of adjusting to do. Gotta break these in. Hey, I just realized there are three different styles of uh, designs. You have this, I don't know what this is called, round uh, boat shoes. You have a typical round, and this is the pointy one. Which do you guys prefer? I think most of the time I probably prefer something pointy. It just looks more Italian. Let's go ahead and buckle these up. There we go. Look how stylish that buckle is. And if it's ever loose, you can also tighten it in the uh, the midsole. Okay, let's go ahead and hide this out. Wearing jeans. Typically, I can wear shoes anywhere from size 8 to size 9. A bigger size on athletics, smaller on dress shoes. So a size 8, yeah, that looks like I have about half inch of room. That makes it for a snug and comfortable fit. How does it look? Since I'm wearing jeans, I think I covered up two of the important polo logos. The one in the rear, very like the stylish one. And also, you have this classic circle emblem. But don't worry, because the belt buckle also says polo right there. You 
you know what? This actually is probably one of the more comfortable leather boots I've owned. And I've had like Dr. Martin's, uh, kind of Co. and also Guess. But of course, with the Polar brand, you expect the quality and the comfortness. Yeah, I really like. Just in time for winter too, I can show off even when it's snowing. So if you are in the market for a classics and elegant style of leather boots that will last you a long time, definitely give the Polo Ralph Lauren Ranger Tumbler boots a look.